Condoleezza Rice was planning on speaking at a commencement at Rutgers University. Uh, it was going to take place in late May, and she was going to get paid about $35,000 to do it. <coughs> well, a group of protesters, a group of students and faculty members, protested her speech, uh, or the idea of her giving a speech at the commencement, and released a statement. Here's what they had to say. Rice signed off to give the CIA authority con to conduct their torture tactics for gathering information from detainees as well. These are clearly human rights issues. By inviting her to speak and awarding her an honorary degree, we are encouraging and perpetuating a world that justifies torture and debases humanity. So they were completely against uh, some of the tactics that were used, some of the enhanced interrogation that was used uh, <laughs> during the Bush administration. And so it got to a point where Condoleezza Rice decided, you know what, I'm just not going to give this speech. I am now a distraction. In fact, she released a statement saying the following, commencement should be a time of joyous celebration for the graduates and their families. Rutgers' invitation to me to speak has become a distraction for the university community at this very special time. I actually really like that statement because she's absolutely right. If it were a random speech that she's giving at the university, I would say, you know what, we need to be an open marketplace of ideas, allow her to give the speech even if you're against her and her policy ideas. But when it comes to graduation, when it comes to commencement, people want to celebrate, they want to feel good that day. Having someone there that is not a fan favorite is probably not a good idea. <laughs> yeah. um, fan favorite. And I like, I like that, that Rutgers didn't have to tell her no, they didn't have to, you know, basically get rid of her or whatever. She decided on her own and she released a pretty good statement about it. Yeah. Now college Republicans are upset about it, and they're saying, no, 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 we want her there, this is ridiculous, how dare you, it's a free speech issue. It's not a free speech issue because the government didn't go in there and ban her, she decided on her own that she didn't want to give the speech. Yeah, and now Paul Wolfowitz is going to be speaking. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> I'll say this, you know what else is a huge distraction? Uh, ordering war crimes and indulging in the depravity of torture. Those are also distractions. But I appreciate also protests about her speaking. They, those could also be distractions. And they're all distractions from Benghazi. <laughs> yeah, oh, that's yeah, the real. problem. You know, the, even real. the graduation, I find to be a little bit of a distraction. The graduation itself, a huge distraction when are we from gonna Benghazi. Get to, yes, when yeah. are we going to get to the bottom of this Benghazi? <laughs> and uh, it's li it's, I like that you mentioned it's in, they call it enhanced. Yeah, enhanced. they made it better. It's right. not torture, yeah. it's enhanced. Sounds nice, yeah. right? Enhanced oh, it's enhanced? You're going to put on some mood music and some track lighting? Then we're going <laughs> to hook your balls up to a car battery, and then we're going to drown you. Oh, I'll take the regular. <laughs>